guys and welcome back so i'm doing a haul for my sister she went and bought some stuff for my son at burlington and at academy and i also bought my son something at burlington but it is going to be a different haul because i bought some home decor stuff I have to take stuff out of my house, especially the clutter, and I am donating everything to uh, Salvation Army and my local Goodwill because I just definitely don't need that stuff. It's just a, lot, a long story of uh, why I have so much stuff in my home. So, if you want to see me decluttering my home and stuff like that, I definitely will not post it on this channel. You will have to go to my new channel, which is Andrea Michelle Cleaning Lifestyle. That's Andrea Michelle cleaning loss lifestyle and check me out over there i haven't been posting over there a little bit um under two weeks um but i just need to get myself together and get back in the progress get back with the program because i've been missing you guys so much if you're new to my channel hi how you doing hello 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 nice to see you nice to meet you i'm glad you are peeking in um and definitely stay tuned so you can watch this haul that i got um i am doing just mostly hauls on this channel because i know what you guys like and i'm just gonna start um putting a, a good content out for you guys as well and whenever i go to a store whatever and you guys want to go with me to a store we want to go okay so i thank you guys so much for staying staying down and staying with me we about to hit 6k what so i'm really really excited and it just makes me happy i love this my sphere and you guys know the chaos that i go through on a daily basis because i'm a single mom i'm a boss mom as well to 20 different employees <laughs> So my day is always chaotic and then school is starting so I have a first grader on my hands. My son is growing up like, oh, like whoo, he's growing up like a sprout so I have to keep up with him too as well and I definitely have to keep up with you guys so let me know in the comments below like what do you guys want to see with my videos next because I am open. Um, if you want to see me do a mukbang let me know but I'm going to try to stick to my hauls um, and stuff like that. For now on because I have a lot of hauls that I need to share with you guys and get out. But if you have any ideas, then let me know. I'm going to also be um, showing you guys how I um, fix Ashton's lunch for school. And it's going to be like basically for two whole weeks. And then after that, I probably won't do it anymore. Just here and there. Um, because I don't want to bore you guys out. I know what you came for. I know what you want. And you want this. Okay. You want the haul. So from Burlington, my sister got my son an outfit, which is Jordan. Because he is up on his Jordan game. So the retail price is $30 in the stores just for a shirt. But my, I think my sister, this don't even have a receipt on it. But I think, I don't know what the original price is for this or whatever but just know the original price in the stores was $30 I know this couldn't have been $30 it's probably like $7 um oh here's the tag right here oh it was $14.99 so she saved a grip of money on the shirt so she bought him this and it also is just a black shirt in the back he's gonna wear this more towards like when he gets out of school he's at home he's just relaxing or if we go somewhere and these are the shorts that goes with it and then it has like the little Jordan logo on the back on the side and then on the side has Jordan like Jordan logo I'm not sure what the original price okay here we go the original price was $40 for the shorts I would never pay $40 for just a pair of shorts you guys y'all know I am a mama on a budget and I'm El Cheapo, okay? I straight stay cheap, okay? Uh, if it ain't DDs, it ain't right. If it ain't Ross, it ain't right. Um, if it ain't the Goodwill or the thrift stores, it ain't right. <laughs> um, so, but she paid $12.99 for these, and I definitely probably would have never paid $12 for these. The only thing mostly I pay $12 for in the store for my son um, is some underwear and some socks. And he did get some underwear and socks, but I would not be showing you guys his underwear and socks and stuff like that. But I will show you what my sister bought because she's not here. She can't. She's actually at work and she can't show you guys. So the socks that she bought, Ashton, she bought him three pair of socks on clearance at Burlington. Um, and these, the original price for these socks, which I think is really cute, was sixteen dollars. 
and she only paid $9.98 for them so that's a great deal and she, he has like all these different kinds of colors I love these right here myself I may have to cop that okay and then she bought him some more socks just one pair of socks Under Armour socks and the original price on these were $13 and then she only paid $4.98 for them. And then she found some more Under Armors for, um, the original price was $16. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it don't have like a little tag or whatever. But she said she got them on clearance. So, yeah, I hope she really got them on clearance because they don't have a little thing on them. And she bought some more outfits. Oh, this stuff is from Academy. I'm sorry. She bought this stuff. So I'm pulling out the back here. It's from Academy. So we're done with the Burlington um, outfit, which was the Jordan. So the socks came from Academy, Academy as well. Um, okay, so this shirt that I got here is a Nike shirt, I believe. Yeah. And so this shirt, original price at a, Academy is $25. And it was on sale for $15.99. And this is what it looks like. I like it. It's really nice. My sister always keeps my son dressed really nice and stuff like that, like me. But she's his auntie, so she feels like she's got to out, like, outdo me, outshine mama. So <laughs> I let her do it because, you know, you're helping me out, you know. She's helping me out a whole lot. So uh, if she wants to spoil my baby, she can spoil him. I'm not going to say no. Um, so I don't know the price on these, but these are the shorts that she bought him, wanted to buy him. And these are also Nike, but they don't have, like, a tag or anything. Just this. That's what it looks like, I guess. So, yeah, she bought those. So, these are basically for, like, park dates and stuff like that. Because we're going to have a, probably a whole lot of park dates. I'm really excited, too, about that. My son's going to be having, like, all these friends and stuff. So, she bought him some more shorts. They were $32, original price, and or retail price. And then she paid $29.99 for these shorts. I told her, why don't buy him all that expensive stuff. She could have just went to Marshall's or she could have went to Burlington like I did and spent a little lesser than what, you know, um, <clears throat> what she's paying for this stuff. So this is Nike too. And that's what it looks like on the side. I really like these right here. Like just to like go running in or something. And then she bought them on top to go with that. My sister always goes spending crazy on my son. So, original price for this is $20, this shirt. Um, and she only paid $15.99 for it. So, my sister spent some good, some good money on my son, like over $100. And then this comes with like a little sticker of some sort. So, this is what this shirt looks like. And then it's just all black on the back. Um, then she got him some shoes from Academy as well. Let me see what she, how much she spent on him. Oh, wow. You guys. Okay, so this is the Academy receipt. I don't want to show too much of anything. This is the receipt here. And let me get the credit card number off so you guys can see. So, she spent, her original price was... What, $143 and some change, 36 cents, I guess, 39 cents. With taxes, it's $11.83, and she spent the total of $155.22 on her nephew. <laughs> she spent a ton of money on my son. Um, and I know it's not over, because she's still trying to buy him other things. Like, as we speak, when she get off of work, she says she's going to try to go and get him some more stuff so we got some shoes here some nikes these shoes were i don't know they don't have a price let me see hold on you guys i'm so sorry i'm not put together i'm just really like overwhelmed because my sister bought so much stuff for my kid oh my gosh um these shoes were only 39.99 they were $39.99 and they're Nikes. And she got him these shoes. These are really nice. Just all black Nike shoes. And they're really, really easy. I recommend these to all moms or any mom I come across. 
um, that get their kids shoes, especially when they're at school and they cannot tie their shoes yet. My kiddo, I bought him these type of shoes where he can just put his feet in and go. He don't have to worry about shoestrings and stuff like that. And he's a boy and my son, he'll just tuck his shoestrings in or whatever because he doesn't know how to tie his shoes. It's not like I haven't taught him to tie his shoes. He just don't, he's just lazy when it comes to tie his shoes, just to be honest. My son is lazy when it comes to tie shoes. So I recommend any mom that have a child <laughs> or kids that do not like tying their shoes or do not have the time at school to tie their shoes because of their shoestrings getting into the way. Um, I see a lot of kids with their shoestrings untied and stuff like that. And I'm just like, I just wish their parents would um, basically get their shoes, get them shoes just like this or whatever, or whatnot. Um, but most of Ashley's shoes are like this so he won't be able he won't be like confused on how to tie his shoes so yeah but yeah i got he got these my sister bought him these these are really nice and they are um breathable shoes so he can get some air into those shoes so i'm really glad she um bought him some shoes because i bought him some shoes my mom bought him some shoes but they were just a little too tight. My son's feet is so big. Like, you have to get a wide for his feet. A wide shoe for him. So, my sister found him some good shoes. But anyways, you guys, that is the end of the vlog. Thank you guys for coming back to watch my channel here. And then also go to my other channel, which is Andrea Michelle Cleaning Lifestyle. I'm going to be posting some stuff on there next week after he gets into school. Like, into school. So, probably I'll post something on Monday. Just keep myself busy so I won't, like miss him a lot you know so i'll post something on that channel on monday but 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 until i get there definitely go ahead and subscribe to the channel because i definitely don't want you to miss anything on there if you're into organization and cleaning and doing uh, uh cooking and diy and stuff and if you're that type of mom definitely check out that channel but anyways i gotta go y'all stay blessed i'ma stay lit and that's how we gonna do it okay <laughs> bye